hi in this video we learn how to create soap uh, how to create a soap ui test for testing the web service soap web services so for this we need to create the service and publish it in the internet after that we can do that uh, testing of it so first of all in my earlier um, tutorial I have created that uh, math services and uh, already it's uh, like a publish in uh, my tutorial uh, in a www .tutorial by example com and Jack's web services with the job WS import utility and you can watch in my video as well in video sections or with help of that link that link and while clicking over here you'll see that the entire video or you can see that how to create a service while going through the step by step and after that you have to publish that that web services so you'll see and request is that you have to install that SOP UI as well so uh, the further step is also there how to install SOP UI in a Windows 2007 32-bit operating system so you have to follow both creating this first you have to installation of SOP UI second you have to follow that uh, how to create a JAX web services with uh, WS or any other utility or you, you, you need uh, any web service or web services for doing the testing so I have already created I'm just going to use so for this first of all we have to whatever service is there we have to publish it so I have a math service I'll go in like a quick um, just for overview so I have a math service I, I have written that a uh, two method one is add while uh, providing the two param uh, parameter a and parameter b uh, returning a plus b the data type of a and b is uh, double and return type is also double so same is applicable for sub, sub, substract as well instead of a plus i put a minus this is all about my service the url of a service will be going to be something like that a target name a space like this ones after that i have generated that uh, required jaxb object and class and their xxd file and visitor so these things we have to generate with wsgen utility which is already clearly explained in my tutorial jaxb tutorial with the wsgen utility and video is also there in youtube so first we have to after that we have to publish it so that is already published i'll stop as of now no services is running and this is the url with help of that we can access that that services so now i'll go to right click and click run and run as a java applications so with help of that now my service is published now i'll copy this url open the browser I'll type that that name of a service that's in the appearing that like wow I'm able to see that the service is published the visitor locations I need so after that I'm just able to see that our entire visitor what is what is the purpose of that and all so I'll just copy that now for in so why we need that visitor location that's it nothing apart from that with help of this we create a SOPI project and we'll do the testing so my service is available now for access and writing the client code so now I'll go to that uh, in SOPI tool so you have to go to a start um, all program and so py or desktop so ui ui icon will be there you have to double click a window will be opened like this one so as of now there is no project in so py so i have to click on file create create mpt project or new project or rest project whatever you want you can do so our requirement is creating the soap new project after that we have to type that whatever visitor locations is there 
the visitor locations will be over here i will just put that name of the project so math service I'll, I'll put the name of the service or math service tutorial by example and the visitor locations is whatever I copy um, from internet export or publish web services because this is the standard alone web services published so there is nothing need to start a stop in tomcat that will be embedded in jdk only and it will be re um, ready to consume it as of now so after that i have just um, placed that initial visual and name of the project by default i let it be create request test case i'll let not do as of now and click on the ok after the clicking the ok i'm able to see that the add and subtracts both request is there only one so now in service we have just created <coughs> two method add and subtracts so in soap ui also we are able to see add and subtracts and both request is there so in the uh, now we are able to see that envelope in envelope we have envelope envelope header body and the name of the method and both parameter and subsequent the closing of the tag as well so we are getting the two questions mark question mark first for first parameter i'll put the 100 and second one i'll put that a 200 so now as per our business logic if i'll pass that a parameter a is equal to 100 b is equal to 200 so our logic is for red is equal to a plus b so our expectations is output must be a 300 so for running this one i have to click the run request wow so as per expected now we it's returning 300 so this is the success scenario we are able to see that something some result so this is all about how to do that initial testing in sop ui now we can create that another request or other cases like a mock new request where we can put that request to i'll put that instead of a number i'll put that one i'll put that a and i'll put that two so this is as per expectations it must be a double now i'm putting that wrong then there is a failure a plus two is equal to okay well it's considering um, is equal to something wrong data type so it will casting by default and second one it's returning okay 2 plus 3 is equal to second parameter 5 that's fine so accordingly we can uh, set that is some negative parameter as well and which will be like a throw that is some exceptions like a a plus b so nothing is there no data type so by default it's taking the zero and zero plus zero is equal to zero so this is all about how to test so accordingly you can also do the test of structs as well like four minus two equals to two okay so you can see that a number of requests and response and you can test it accordingly and um, for this i'm um, just recap, re recapping for this you have to create the on service class where you have to publish the test service and you have to install the test op ui so installation is already there over here in my link www.tutorialexample.com some link whatever is highlighted and uh, Mm, the second link you have to do that uh, in, in the uh, publishing the services so you can go through that in web services and the already link is there in ws uh, gen utility you have to click over here you will able to see that uh, everything in like in visual format from my in this video or textual you can refer from that whatever i'm navigating over here so this is all about how to create a sop ui test um, so how to do the sop test in a sop ui 
with have any web, web, web services published that's the that's all about and hope oh, hope you have enjoyed while watching watching my video please like and share it don't forget to subscribe